Hello, this is an announcement video for 24 Hour Movie Marathon 6. I almost did 7 then, it's definitely 6. Uh, this year is the 5th anniversary of the 24 Hour Movie Marathon. Started by Ryan Shattaway and I will be doing it again this year. I want to let you guys know that I'm definitely doing it. There's been some confusion uh, with some people because I've kind of announced it on Facebook. Some people haven't seen it, some people thought I really wasn't going to do another marathon after last year's one. All I can say about that in a nutshell is it was part of the storyline, I guess, in the same way that in Marathon 4 I allegedly sold all my movies, which we know didn't happen. Uh, so, Return of the Marathon, Marathon 6, is happening this year. We'll be filming it in April, and it'll be coming out at some point in May. I'm not sure when. Probably towards the end of the month is a more kind of realistic um, estimate, I suppose. So it's going to take a lot of time to put together, as always. I can't wait. Uh, in fact, today, right now, Ryan Shatway is doing his 24-hour movie marathon, so to me that feels like the beginning of marathon season. It's really cool to see that uh, other people are getting involved this year, and it feels like it's ramping up. There's people who haven't done it before who are thinking of doing it, um, like A Touch of Film. He's going to do it, which is really cool. I'm interested to see how he'll tackle it in terms of his video. Uh, someone like Stiff Kittens is going to be doing it, and he doesn't do videos where his face is on camera, but he's going to do it anyway. So I, I love it that people will, will try and do it, uh, you know, and kind of fit it to their style of making videos. And uh, I, I just like seeing all the different interpretations of how you make the video of doing your 24-hour movie marathon. And I can't wait to start mine. We're going to do it in a couple of weeks. And I also wanted to announce uh, something different I'm doing with it this year, which I wanted to do last year. I kind of got cold feet about it. I wasn't sure whether to do it or not, whether it was right to do it or not. And this year I'm going to decide to just, to just do it and just go out on a whim and see if it works. I'm going to partner up with a charity this year in conjunction with 24 Hour Movie Marathon 6 uh, to raise some money. Uh, and I think that it's something that hasn't really been done in the community before. I know that a lot of YouTubers do charity work and things like that, but in the YouTube movie community, I don't think I've ever seen it. And it might be done before, but to me it feels like something different and kind of untested waters. So I'm unsure whether this is even a good idea, but I, I can't see how it would be a bad idea. Uh, and so what I've done is I've set up a Just Giving page. I'll leave a link to that down below, obviously. You can go check it out. The page will be live as of this video going up. And the kind of the fundraising campaign will go for a couple of months until the marathon video comes out and probably a few weeks after that. So, I mean, you can go over there now if you want and kind of support or you can wait until the marathon video comes out. See if you enjoy it. If you do, throw a few quid in there. That's basically the idea with this. And uh, the goal I've set is £100, which might seem like a lot. Uh, to me, it feels like it's not that much, but it's a lot at the same time. Because this is a very small channel, you know, and my marathon videos get a couple of thousand views. And my feeling is, you know, if a lot of people enjoyed that video and they feel like contributing to this charity, then, you know, we could make a little bit of money. It'd be a cool kind of positive thing to do with something that's already very positive and, and that I love doing. So hopefully, uh, it works and hopefully a few people donate. I'm going to be donating money myself. I'm going to pledge uh, all of my ad revenue for the next two months of my channel because I don't make much through ad uh, revenue, uh, especially not on the marathon video itself, which I probably won't be able to monetize because last year I got caught with the claim for showing like two seconds of Rocky, not Rocky, uh, Rambo 3 of all things, just like a couple of seconds of that on the TV and they're like, nope, claimed. So the marathon video isn't going to make any money. But for the next two months of my channel, I'll be taking that and putting that into the fundraiser and trying to get up to that £100 goal. I think it's a, it's a realistic goal, hopefully. Uh, and if not, at least I'm going to put some money into it. And I've talked to Ryan Chataway, the creator of the marathon, and he's really behind this idea. He said he's going to contribute as well. Uh, and yeah, so that's the announcement, basically, to, to tell you about this kind of uh, this fundraising campaign I'm starting with the marathon. And I feel like I spent about a month kind of making these videos. You're getting like at least a three hour long video, if not longer. Uh, and so I don't feel like it's unreasonable to kind of, um, you know, to link a charity with this and hopefully it works again uh, I kind of I feel nervous about doing it, which is why I didn't do it last year But hopefully you guys are receptive to it and support um, at least the idea of it Even if you're not going to support um, monetarily, which is fine as well again. This isn't some kind of mandatory thing at all whatsoever. Now the charity I've chosen to team up with for the marathon is Little People UK and I really feel strongly about this because it's just again a smaller grassroots kind of charity that doesn't get that much big attention like other ones and and this isn't going to raise that much money. I mean who are we kidding you know. Uh, I doubt we'll even reach the goal of a hundred pounds. Um, so I feel like uh, anything that we raise here, if we do raise it, uh, would be kind of, I don't know, ill-used on one of the bigger charities that get a lot more attention from people who do uh, a lot more uh, impressive things than a movie marathon uh, to raise money, and rightfully so, to raise more money. Uh, so I feel like a, a smaller charity like, like this really works hand in hand and is more beneficial to everyone involved. Uh, so that's kind of my feeling on it. I've spent a few weeks kind of 
deciding which one to go with uh, as uh, I feel very strongly about this one so I hope you guys are on board with it and yeah I'm, I'm really excited to hopefully uh, turn this real positive thing for my channel into a positive thing for other people as well uh, not only just people enjoying the video but to give back to, to a charity in some small way no, no matter how small I feel like it'll be a really cool thing and I'd be really uh, proud if we could get this going and, uh, and raise a bit of money for charity uh, while having some fun uh, talking about movies and all that kind of stuff. So that's it. Uh, thank you for watching. Uh, again, the Just Giving page link is down below. I'll see you in the next video. And uh, oh, and as for the marathon video itself, uh, it will be a bit different from last year. I definitely want to cut the length down significantly. Obviously, last year's 24-hour movie marathon five was uh, six and a half hours long. Uh, I want to cut that down at least in half. Uh, and I have uh, plans in effect that will will make this happen. Uh, so I feel like it would be better if you, can, if you could feasibly watch it in one sitting as opposed to six and a half hours long which is an unreasonable length to watch in one sitting so I want to make it shorter but it'll still be again you're probably looking at about three hours long anyway so it's going to be a meaty marathon video like always you'll have special appearances from other people there's a lot of things in the works um, and I'm really excited about it as always I hope you're, hope you're looking forward to it and uh, I'll see you in the next video Alright by me <laughs> Apart from the fact he throws cans and call it into a tree <laughs> Yeah he's really cool Yeah he's really cool But he's not quite as cool as you cause